Hey everybody, how are you doing? Just wanted to say happy Thanksgiving and that I miss you all. Wish I was back there in the States with you guys having wonderful Thanksgiving dinners. Um, as you can tell, the camera's shaking a little bit so it is a little bit windy here, but also I'm in freaking short sleeves. It's like 75 degrees here right now, so I don't really have much to complain about weather-wise. <laughs> Uh, that's something I'm thankful for, um, but I am also thankful for Alice. She's trying to make a little Thanksgiving dinner for me here that we're going to have tonight. We've got some ham. She's making up some green bean casserole and we're have some macaroni and cheese to go along with it. So I will have a small Thanksgiving dinner here in Taiwan. Happy about that. Um, I do wish I was back at home with you guys while watching football. Definitely a tradition I'm going to miss and I'm still getting used to. Uh, but just wanted to hop on here and give you a quick kind of life update video. Uh, I did have the second surgery on my arm. Everything is healing up just fine. Uh, everything's lined up correctly. Just right now have this brace on here. There is a rod in my arm from probably about here down maybe about there so I can't really go like that with this arm my arms kind of locked in place right now so they're just having me focus on doing this kind of motion because I can do that with my left hand can't really get all the way around with my right yet so mm, that hurts a little bit uh, they're just having me work on doing that range of motion right now but I have that rod in me till about April, I think, and then they'll take it out. So I'll have to go in for a third surgery to take that out. But then finally I'll be able to have my full range of motion back. Um, so that's the update there with the arm. Um, let's see, I mean, we're planning on the Japan trip day after Christmas we're heading to Japan finally for our honeymoon we're going to Kyoto Osaka uh, Tokyo probably a day trip over to Nara Japan um, I don't know if you know about Nara but there's all there's deer like all over that city and like you can just like walk up to them and pet them and feed them and it's perfectly fine so that's something we're looking forward to um, and then also just visiting all the temples and everything cool technologically in Japan that they have there. I'm looking forward to that part. So that's about a little bit more than a month away. So we're trying, this weekend we're going to work on kind of planning out each day, what we want to do each day where we're at. Um, we have like uh, Universal Studios Japan uh, scheduled for a day and a half while we're in Osaka. Um, I'm going, I'm bringing Alice and we're going to Tokyo one, on January 4th uh, for a pro wrestling event. It's New Japan Pro Wrestling. It's called Wrestle Kingdom. It's basically their version of Wrestlemania. So the biggest wrestling event of the year in Japan. Just happens to be having happening while we're there coincidence maybe maybe I planned that who knows um, but yeah um, so those are kind of the two main things I'm looking forward to but also just all the little things trying out cool new restaurants um, visiting museums stuff like that but uh, we're gonna try to have a nice Thanksgiving meal tonight and this weekend and We'll try to have a nice little small Christmas here as well. I have some Christmas decorations up in our apartment. I've, I'll post some more pictures of the little kind of Taiwanese uh, Christmas tree that I have kind of created. We have a small little tiny like table size regular Christmas tree as well. Um, but kind of just trying to do the best I can um, with what's available to me here. Uh, as far as my teaching gig is concerned, everything's going pretty well with that. The kids are very smart. Um, 
always impressed with how quickly they pick up the information that I'm teaching. Um, might have an occasional rough day here and there where the kids get a little bit too wild for me or um, maybe I'm not as prepared as I should be for a lesson. Uh, but overall, it's going really good. Um, so much so that, I mean, we'll see what happens this year. Uh, we still have all of the second semester to go. Um, but who knows, maybe next August I'll pick up a second class or like private tutoring or something to get uh, a little bit more income on my own here. Uh, but I mean, overall, things are going probably better than I expected it for being here for what now eight months been here since March um, I'd love to come back and visit you all sometime in 2024 we'll see how that wraps up see what we can get planned out I mean we'll see I mean we want to progress Alice and I want to progress with our lives here, kind of go on to the next step with both of our careers and even maybe like family stuff. Uh, who knows? I mean, she's probably going to hate me for saying this, but maybe baby in 2024, maybe early 2025. Nothing has happened yet. Don't worry, nothing's happened yet. So, Alice, if you see it, sorry for kind of throwing this out there to the family. But, I don't know. I think I'm kind of ready for that next stage of my life. But, of course, we have to figure out finances, figure out life. Like I said, I still want to make a trip back with her to the States to visit you all or visit other parts of the country. I never actually got a chance to visit uh, while we were living there. Um, kind of maybe make like a month or a two month, three month trip just to go around the country, different spots for a week here, a week there. Um, kind of have something planned out in my mind of just like a dream U.S. vacation. Um, but that's, that's for another day to figure out. Um, but yeah, that's kind of just life update here. I'm kind of just sitting in the park, enjoying the fresh weather, fresh air. Uh, sunset here, it's about 5.20 right now, so the sun's starting to go down. But like I said, it's still like 75 degrees here, so I can't really complain. I know it's much, much cooler, colder back at home. I hope you guys are all doing well. I hope you all are healthy. hope you're able to get together with family and friends on this Thanksgiving weekend and enjoy a lot of football for me. Um, I can't really think uh, too much more to say, but besides I love you guys. I miss you guys. I hope to see you at some point, 2024, early 2025. We'll try to figure it out best we can. Um, I don't know. Life's wild. Life is wild. Life is crazy. And right now I'm kind of just living it one day at a time. And we'll just see what's next. Love you guys. Peace. Take care.